item number nine on our agenda, attendance policy appointed. Yes, Madam Chairman, um, since we, our chairman is not here and we have um, now six of our 11 members present, I would much prefer mm -hmm. that we postpone discussion on this to okay. the November work session. Um, well, I have a draft or a revised draft of the language, which I can email to you. We can discuss this at the last work session. I was going to put some more details in it. I have done that, but I have left some blanks in terms of examples of excused absences. That really ought to be the focus of our next discussion. So I would like to commute that to the November meetings. Do I have to make um, a motion? Okay. This is not a formal agenda. Okay. Well, the next, the next item is item number 10, our meeting schedule for the 2014. Yes, ma'am. I um, checked in with the chairman last work session. Please just try to communicate any potential changes uh, or recommendations you might have to Ms. Carmella. Um, she very graciously prepared that calendar. Try to be very fair. Uh, ultimately, I think that uh, Chairman Ball said, please bring it back to our November agenda so we can have an official vote on it to set our schedule going forward. But please check those dates at least two of them do accommodate for holidays we're moving it to a tuesday meeting um, please double check them with your schedules and, and let us know if you have any comments on it. okay any other well, items on yeah one is just the fault that pops into mind it's a little early in one way but not in others in terms of calendars and schedules um, we sometimes have a holiday gathering for ourselves um, usually in early December. It might be a good idea to start thinking about that um, so we're not pressed for time at the end of November trying to figure something out. The first question is, do we have one or not? And two, when and where, if we are. What is it usually Well, in years past, um, Bill Slaughter, who used to be a member and was the sitting chairman, he graciously offered his um, facilities um, sort of like a little lake house that he would host a dinner. Mm -hmm. um, he's no longer a member of the Planning Commission, and I'm not sure we can impose ourselves on him or not. So we may need to come up with an alternative. Um, I know in city and counties we used to have budgets for stuff like that, but you no longer. So we have to be more creative. Well, that's why I was going to ask. Kind of, I know one time we had a multi jurisdictional uh, I mean, sure did. board type of uh, holiday gathering. Right. And we've done it like at the city multi-purpose room, and right. we've done it at local venues. Um, so that's not an option this year? We can have something at the city if we can host this facility. We just have no money to pay for items. Um, personally, I think at somewhere other than a government building is a more attractive atmosphere for something like that. What do um, we do with the, the HBC we just pick up? Restaurant or meeting, whoever shows up. Well, that I think varies from year to year. ZBOA, you know, sometimes does their thing. Um, sometimes we've done that after a ZBOA meeting in early December. Um, some years that has worked better than others, you know, depending on what was on the agenda. <laughs> it, it's just something I think it might be good to start thinking about, and maybe we can iron out details. Remember, works out. Okay. If we don't have any other comments from the meeting, the meeting is adjourned. Okay.